Hello everybody, how are we doing this morning? Morning. We're uh, still in Castleton. We are. The weather's gone a bit cold though. A bit? Seven degrees of highs today, which mm. ain't going to be very warm at all. We've literally just started the engine up on the van because we've been parked here three and a half days, haven't we? Yeah. Or three, about, yeah. about three full days at the minute. Mm -hmm. <coughs> but we need water, so we're going to just pack stuff away and head and try and find some water. And I think we're going to have one more night here. And then head back because obviously it's Mother's Sunday coming up, isn't it? It is. And we can't forget that, can nope. we? We can't forget that. Nope. Bailey's shaking away down there. It's not that cold, mate. Right, it's because you started the engine, he knows we're moving. Oh, yeah, he gets a bit... A bit worked up. A bit stressed out in the morning. But this morning we're saying goodbye to our friends at Suzanne. We've got no step out here. She's heading off on her travels. Packing a van away now, and uh, yeah, we'll go and try and find some water, and then we'll try and get parked back up here. We should be able to get parked up here. Plenty of spaces around, some more up there. We normally try and get over there because the, the ground's a bit leveler there. Here we're leaning back corner, so it's been a little bit of a pain, but can't complain. There she goes. Off on her travels. Oh, that wind's fresh. She in there. It's going off. Always waiting around for a woman. <laughs> Just popped into Hope. We've got this car park here, and there's a spa shop opposite that pub. So bottled water. So I'll keep us going till tomorrow. Catherine's just strapping the dog back in and uh, we'll head back up to um, Broken Road but there's also public toilets here you can use as well which is quite handy made it back and uh, we were parked over there before but we parked this side this time getting out onto the road but to be honest it's that cold out there we ain't going to be getting in and out very often and uh, you can level the van a little bit better on this side that side is a little bit unlevelable shall we say but i think first job is let's get the diesel eater filled up as much as we can well yeah this is where we'd normally park this side of the road so he's took the mirror in a bit less stuck out on the road then that's it we'll get that heater fired up now we'll park up again that's it got a couple of bottles of water it's only like one pound one pound nine p a bottle too bad. Uh, like two litre bottles. Uh, I know a couple of people have, have asked why we drink bottled water rather than the water out of the tap. We've had a lot of people um, ask us lately. And it, we've done it for 20 years. Yeah. We've always bought bottled water. It, that, it's just <coughs> our personal preference. It's just how we do it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's nothing wrong with drinking the water out the tap if you want to. Um, no, as, as long as you make sure your system's clean regularly. We do clean our system regularly, and because we're using it all the time, it's probably cleaner than most, because yeah. a lot of them you leave over winter. And, mm -hmm. But yeah, we've always drunk bottled water, and it's that cheap, so I don't see... Yeah. Uh, now and again, we'll re refill these, though, at a tap, won't we? Yeah, yeah, we'll refill them once or twice, and then we dispose of them, but... Yeah, so we don't... It's not purely bottled water, but we reuse the bottles. I know some people say you don't reuse the bottles, but... Yeah. We've done it for 20 years, and we're still alive, so that yeah, was... Yeah, that's it. And as with the plastic, <coughs> I crush them down, put the lid on, so they're so small, in a recycling bin. But yeah, water in the van situation... Uh, we're leaning a bit, so it says 75%. Um, so we've washed the pots several times. Um, we've all had a shower each, mm -hmm. including Sue's. Including Sue's, yeah, she's had one um, as well. So we can normally get like two showers each and enough pots. Mm -hmm. um, obviously they're not the best showers, are they? It's just a quick wet down yeah. and a, a van shower, should mm -hmm. we say. So we can make that water last a week. Yeah. And the toilet, we can equally make that last nearly a week. We're using the bottle that I use. Yeah. And then really we just bring down to the public toilets and then get rid of the bottle waste. Yeah. That's it. Um, well, the, and the bin waste, you notice I took the bin waste out? No, I didn't notice. Yes, I got rid of all the rubbish. Aren't I good? Yes, dear. So we're going to have a brew now, and then mm -hmm. we're going to sit down and is admire the view. Is it Formula 1 this weekend? Yes, qualifying's on later. There we go. Saudi Arabia. Oh. So yeah, we're just going to sit. We've got the same view as we had yesterday. 
or this morning but we were parked over there so got a few vans behind us down there yeah keep it's quite, us company quite a few here last night weren't there yeah it's the weather has turned a bit cold mm, it's a lovely noise as well you know when you take the dog out on an evening and there's other vans you can just do tick 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 all tick, the diesel tick, eaters. all the diesel eaters every van in the row <laughs> This is the reality of being in a van, ain't it, Catherine, in the same spot? Boredom. boredom. We're boredom today. Mm -hmm. We've been sat watching rubbish. We're not boredom, On we're bored. YouTube. <laughs> yeah, we're completely bored. <laughs> and Catherine says, I know what I'm going to do for half an hour. Please. I'm going to change your bed, because it's woohoo, so exciting. Change your bed. And for anybody that um, hasn't got a cup yet, we've still got... That is on the left. Yeah, just have a dozen cups left. There we are. We can post them out or you can collect them from us if you're nearby yep just send us a message on the fieldview facebook page and Catherine will sort one out i shall oh look at that oh what's that it's like an old ambulance uh -huh. huh. old either a g reg or a c reg old one oh. cool that's the most excitement we've had in the last three hours loads of people turning up it's friday today so yeah. <coughs> we expect that there's going to be quite a few vans turning up what if that ambulance looks like a comma or something maybe something like that yeah we've uh, met a couple of subscribers no yeah. doubt if we stay tonight and tomorrow we'll probably meet another one or two maybe so so it's a bit of a not a lot day no, Catherine's bought some chocolates here for Mother's Day, but I'm tempted um, to. You're not touching them. I'm tempted to eat them. No, Look at these. Because they're expensive, like luxury chocolates. Expensive luxury. I could eat them in about three seconds. Exactly. Flat. So you're not going to. Leave. <laughs> I'd have hidden them somewhere better than that. <laughs> so yes, nobody will ever understand the struggles of changing a bedding. Yeah. Imagine changing this bedding look. Yeah. Where you've only got a tiny bit of room here to, to stand. Apparently, it's difficult. And you've got crap everywhere. I ain't got, I ain't got crap everywhere. It's, it's parts for power banks I know. I know. and instruction books and stuff because we've run out of cupboard space. And trainers. And, and my TikTok trainers. Oh, that reminds me. Um, <coughs> we've got a couple more TikTok parcels to pick up uh, tomorrow. So we're heading back sort of homebound tomorrow to pick up these other parcels and Catherine stamps and any mail what's come um, and then we're hanging around for a couple of days because it's mother sunday and um then we've got some appointments next week so we're not quite sure where we're heading are we no we're not going to be going far away are we for the next week so we've got no. quite a few bits and bobs on so yes yeah, so we've got a few bits and bobs on and a week well a week today we've been the Netherlands so uh, we're getting ready for that aren't we a week today uh, a month four today, weeks even. today four weeks today four yeah. weeks today not a week today blimey I'll correct myself <laughs> so I corrected myself then because somebody moaned at me in the comments saying I get things wrong we do get things wrong we're, we're human, human. <laughs> but yes <coughs> we do we do say you can say some real stupid things sometimes and sometimes yeah. you don't pick up on it yourself because you're too busy looking at the camera so mm. yeah yeah thanks for pointing them out but yeah we're not perfect so no you have to get over it and for anybody who says i don't do it look <laughs> one hand on the duvet one hand on the camera having a super king size duvet in a van this is yeah it's this, hard work getting the duvet in. This is the struggles. I know. It's a nice duvet though. It is a nice duvet. It's like a um, microfiber, I think it's. Yeah, it my, yeah. It is very cosy. Um, but we've had a few comments just lately, haven't we, about you not uh, helping. Yes, and, and I don't. There is a reason for that. I don't help at all. I do nothing. No, there is a reason <laughs> for that. I normally Don't bother say, me what people say. I normally say, leave me alone to do my jobs. It's as simple as that. There's no interfering, no helping, unless I ask him to. No, it's not just that. It's, if I'm filming, I'm not doing something. <coughs> so, I'm not bothered. If people want to think I do, no, <laughs> think it. But we, we have had a lot of that just lately, and mm. it's, it's not fair. We have a few. We yes, have a few. it's not fair. Yes, you only get to see 
what I put on the film. Yes. And if I'm holding the camera, which I generally am, yep. then I'm not doing anything while I'm holding the camera. Well, because you can't. Well, yeah. Anyway, crack on oh. while I go and sit down and do know. Yeah, go on, go sit back down on your bottom. Well, morning, everybody. It was not long got up, just taking uh, Bailey out for his morning whittle. He's got his jumper on this morning. It's a tad fresh out. <coughs> a little bit fresh overnight. A bit misty today. A bit cold out here, though. Hmm? He's shivering even with his jumper on. <laughs> Aren't you? Yes, it's not a bad morning. It's not as cold as it has been. It has been really, really, really cold. Time to go back in and see if they're ready and get a cuppa, I think. My head is frozen. Should have put my hat on this morning. Just been talking to a subscriber back there. I uh, didn't catch your name, sorry, buddy. But uh, yeah, always nice to chat to people. Come on, then, buddy. Yeah, a few vans here, not that busy for Friday night, there's a few more up there. Yeah, right, Zach, do you sleep well? Yeah. Catherine's doing the duties of putting the bed away. Oh, got, I've only got a few pots to wash, look, doing well. <laughs> and then we'll be heading off. Parcels to pick, TikTok parcels to pick up as well, Zach. <laughs> Bought Zach a, uh, one of them smart watches as well. Yeah. You want to see some of the um, wallpapers you can get? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Your mum was showing me the wallpapers. There's some right cool ones you'd like, like Kari ones. There's all sorts oh, of cool. games on it as well. Games. Nice. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right down there, buddy. I'm ready. I'm ready for my salmon and biscuits, Dad. Yeah, we had a uh, question about his salmon, didn't we, as well? Yeah. Did you answer them? I did, yes. Yes, we used, we just used the tin salmon from Aldi. Yeah. That's all um, we use. It does have bones in it, but not a lot. Yeah, they're not like... Uh, but the bones are edible anyway in salmon, yeah. so... Yeah, it's not like buying fresh fish where it's probably a bit dodgy. Yeah. Um, we did think about that, but then you've got to keep sort of buying it and cooking it, maybe, I don't know just tin stuff it seems to work he's been on it what now it's yeah been like eight if, months if you go to um lidl and you have the lidl <coughs> app they quite often have uh, two salmon on two for the price of one buy one get one free so just keep an eye on it if you do use it say goodbye to castleton for now bye bye castleton and we'll see you when we get back back in the secret location and the sun's out don't know where Catherine's gone she's took the dog out somewhere and it's actually not cold is it Zach? no not really it was cold in the peaks but it's all right here so uh, I think first job is get a spot of lunch and uh, absolutely bedlam in Retford coming through, so we think we're going to wait and go shopping a bit later on today. Uh, what do you reckon? So I think first job is get lunch and then go and get us parcels and us mail. I better consult the boss when she gets back. That's my parcels picked up and for post. <laughs> Beautiful out there today, it's isn't it? Glorious now, it is. That thing up in the sky up there. <laughs> Yes, I'm intrigued to get into these and see how good these are. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. Says, when you keep buying stuff off that TikTok. I know. <laughs> I mean, addicted. I'm not addicted. I just 
Just like buying stuff. It's like one of them watches and they're like eight, I think eight pound thirty as was, so mm. not a lot of money at all. No. Are we going to venture to the shop supermarket next? Mm -hmm. It's one o'clock yeah, on a Saturday. Yeah, we'll, we'll go to Aldi. If we can't get in, we'll just come back later. <sighs> mm. Yeah, we really ought to go now because we're going past, so no. rather than coming back, but it's going to be murder. Do you know what? We don't work. We could come any day of the week, you know. Last time we went We've shopping no it was Saturday. <laughs> yes, Suzanne ate it all. <laughs> yes, Suz, it's all your fault. But yeah, <laughs> diesel's expensive round Retford. I don't know how much it is round where you are, but it's, it's really expensive round here. 155.9 here. Robbing buggers. Mm. I reckon we could get us van in that uh, car washer there. We'll have to turn it around and do one half at a time. Yeah. Yeah, it's desperate for a wash. I know. While we're at our secret location, I think we should give it a wash. Oh dear, the lights have gone red again, shouldn't we? Mm. We'll have to nick some of your dad's car wash <laughs> <laughs> or caravan wash. We've run out of it, haven't we? Yeah. Yep. So we just popped Aldi's just over there. It's got the world's smallest car park, but let's hope we can get the motor home in this one, can we? Definitely not. We struggle to get a car in it. Quite a few cars just came out, so we're hoping that's a good sign. <laughs> Yeah, There's one over there, places. one there. Oh, yes, we're alright. Can spot at least two, three. Oh, there's spaces everywhere. Four. That's a surprise. Mm, doesn't it? That is a surprise. That's it. Been to our favourite shop. Oh. Aldi. And now we're skint. Yes. But we'll be in the good books with the mothers. <laughs> a couple of nice bunches of flowers. Smell them. Hmm. It's absolutely glorious it now. Is, isn't it? And we can't stand it, the car park's half empty yeah. now. Well like we've just said everybody will have come early for Mother's Day flowers though, won't they? They will have done, right. I better give you an hand. It's actually official, it's actually red as when we were in the Peak District he said it was gonna be about eight degrees and misty. We've come back to Retford. Beautiful sunshine and it is lovely and warm so let's hope it carries on for the rest of the day and into tomorrow because we definitely need some solar special delivery Zeki special delivery I've got a special delivery in this bag for you special delivery oh, give me the special delivery can't get in for it past the shopping lot yeah sit your send down a minute so I can pass you your TikTok item you ready there you go nice Smartwatch, same as yeah. same as your mum. Just different colour. Should be black, I think. Yeah. Oh, now we've got to try and pull this shopping away. Ugh, no. <coughs> That's playing with his new watch now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right, you found a background. No, uh, it's just some of the preset ones. I was just looking which I ones. There's some better ones. I've got some other goodies really in this bag. Yeah. What else we got in this bag? I got me sent a new pair of sunglasses because it were like. Do you like to spend money? No, <laughs> not at all. Because it's sunny. Yeah, but I've got a pair of polarized sunglasses here, and they were one pound twenty-nine. So we don't like to pay a lot because what I'll end up doing is sitting on them. Yeah. But they're brilliant. You want to look through these? I don't like them when they go yellow. There's only a little bit yellow. Mm. Try them on, Zach. Yeah. I don't like paying a lot for them because I end up breaking them, so yeah. I've got them as well. And Ooh, then we've a little yellow. Then we've got a one of these car chargers. Makes you all love what looks like a pocket. I like polarised. Um nice. this one's got loads of USBs on it because the one in the front we're a bit shorter them, aren't we? Yeah. And I got one with USB C's on because we've got loads of iPhone USB C cables mm -hmm. and uh, no USB C sockets. We're overloading the cigarette lighter with that. <laughs> yeah, so two bit two bits from the old TikTok shop. Oh what well, else? I got uh, air fresheners. I only meant to order five. Loaded the load. Times two. <laughs> yeah. The van will smell nice for a while. Do like these black ice ones, they do smell oh, good. They're my favourite though. And they were like eight quid for ten. Posted. Yeah. So I think that's all right. I'll let Catherine show you her stamps later there in there. Yeah. And I bought the a hoodie. 
a hoodie for oh that's weird material £7.50 it's that weird stuff that's how I feel I don't know if I like that or not mm, that's that if you've got chapped hands it'll stick to it kind of material but I've only got one hoodie so it's like I could do it another a bit one small actually that and maybe I'm a bit big for it Oh, it, it, oh, it's different material inside. All oh, right. It's probably one of them that'll pick all the dirt up on the outside. No, it's perfect. That's all right. <clears throat> nice big hood as well. Oh yes. That's all right. Seven pound right, fifty. Yeah. It's got writing on it and stuff. Mm. Just wanted a black one. That actually feels nice. Yeah, it fits well. Hmm. There we Lovely. go. He's happy now. And uh, yeah, salmon. Yeah. That's the one we get from Aldi. Got your salmon boo. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah. It's actually on offer at the minute, about one pound thirty a tin, down from about one pound seventy. One thirty, yeah. So it's it's not bad at all, is it really? It's not bad. This isn't bad actually. It feels horrible on that. It does feel horrible. Built inside. Oh, it's like micro fleece. It's like fleece built mm. inside. So yeah, that's our TikTok bargains jumper watch uh usb thing Sunglasses. shades and smelly air fresheners time catherine's shutting sun out what are you doing it's blinding zach never mind that we're getting solar <laughs> what's the main thing it is what's up with you did doing down there it's like what's happening dad your heating's not on is it and doors open i think i need to get a shave get a show you before Formula One comes on and I can be disappointed watching the Red Bulls win again yeah Although, same old same old again well it is Saudi Arabia so I would say we've been a street circuit there's high probabilities of safety cars so you never know if I don't watch it I'll probably miss the excitement yeah so I shall be watching it in about two hours time but first let me smarten myself up a bit yes because you look a scruff that's it diesel is going on that sun's going down that temperature soon drops, don't it, Bo? We have to get your jumper off then, eh? Take your jumper off. Oh, yes, then. <laughs> no, a minute, though. I had to warm up first. Yeah. Zach's happy because he's got new games out. Yeah. Well, new game. Not new game, new update. New update, right? Yeah. And you've got a, a watch. Yeah. Like his mum's, hey? Good boy, good boy. It's that time, Catherine. I know, I'm just trying to answer a couple of emails. It's time to be disappointed yeah. in Formula One. The stop and show again this year, is it? Well, we shall see, hopefully. Hopefully not. Hopefully, he'll crash. <laughs> what do you reckon, Sorry, Bo? was that a bit of a wicked laugh? Is it, Bo? <laughs> Bo says, is it, that, is it my time yet? Nearly. It'll be our time soon. I we, know, we ain't got tea on yet. We've got sea bass mm. and potatoes parsley sauce and peas mmm -hmm. mm. sounds good to me we have had a decent bit of fish for ages have we no and um now we'll show you them stamps we bought but at first we need to watch this formula one <laughs> i might even have a glass of wine oh i might just join saturday you. night parked up you. out of the way we had any wine for a while have we no, we haven't had any since we've been yesterday. Good. We've been on, no, we haven't. We didn't no, have we yesterday. haven't yesterday either the because before? I told Suzanne to bring me some yesterday and she wouldn't. <laughs> so we're not her friend anymore. <laughs> nah, I'm only joking. Hey, I'm not your fellow DJ. <laughs> yes, I'm not your fellow DJ, Suzanne. <laughs> right, this starts in a couple of minutes, so yep. watch this. I shall put tea on in a minute when I've just finished these emails. We'll catch up with you after the race to tell you the Stappen's one. <laughs> <laughs> well, I could have saved me sent all that time <laughs> we've not only got one red bull we've got two one two mm. again but the new lad bearman <coughs> he's done yes. really well the young lad in, who stepped into the ferrari for carlos science did yeah. a very sterling job he's um, done amazing especially on a track like that yeah and to see it's a league above us mm. he's mm. f2 driver and he came seventh and then yeah. f1 i think he's done super <sighs> we just had some sea bass Potatoes, we, we, we've had a, parsley sauce and beet peas. We've had a good tea, haven't we? Yeah. Yeah, I haven't had no sea bass for years. Mm. So and even nice Zach's eating it. 
So we've got two lots of stamps. One lot from Zambia and one mm. lot from Catherine's place you used to go to when she was a little girl. I did, from Jersey. From Jersey. Mm, the Channel Islands. So we're just having a look at them, aren't we, to see. Yeah. Gosh, 17p. 17p? You don't get an out for 17p. There's one here for 15p. 8th of December, 17p, but it doesn't say what year. Um, some are stamped. Oh, 1990. Some are stamped where uh, some are ever so little. Mm. You can pick that up on the camera, aren't they? Yeah. Well, this one's not from long ago. It was 40p. <laughs> They're a pound or so now. Oh, 3p. Yeah, but look how pretty they are. Mm. Pretty some of these. Yeah, 3p on that one. Got one with puffins on. 7p, that's got to be the win. Oh no, here's the winner, look. 2p. <laughs> no, 2.5. Is it 2.5p? That one? I don't know. Yeah, 2.5p. Oh. Yeah, some were obviously stamped when they were. Yeah. When they were used. Don't say on that one. No, it's. Uh, I think it's. Some have been. That's a fancy one. But we literally paid, I think it was two quid for these. Yeah. For all these ones from Jersey. I right, paid two pounds for that one and two pounds for that one. What one? That one. Christmas one, 1998. Yeah. And they don't weigh anything, so they're no. not really going to take up any space. Well, that's nice. But, uh, it's a, a war one, look. Seven P. Seven pence. Oh, Wild that, flowers of Jersey, three pence. Huh. This is my favourite one. Can you still lick them I and like stick them? Yeah, a lot of them haven't been used, have they? Well, no, I think no. I think what they do, they steam them off, don't they? Mm, I do like that. That you, one's lovely. You like that one? Yeah, that's my favourite. What about this one? It was like Jerusalem. Minimum postage paid. Jersey. Fascinating. 25th anniversary of liberation, 9th of May 1945. And then what will happen with these is, is they'll all end up in the cupboard. Yeah, they're just nice to look at though, aren't we they? We need a little you box know. to put these in. Or yeah. they're in plastic tubs, we can put them back yeah, in the bag. Yeah, yeah and put them in, in them, a plastic yeah. tub, and mm -hmm. then we'll look out for some more. Mm. And we can um, make it a little like hobby. Yeah. Stamp collecting, which is a hobby. Stamp collecting, it is a hobby, yeah. Mm. People do. Oh, let's get me drop a vino. Oh, yeah, look, ten and a half pence each. Look, those two. Oh, that wine's a bit. Oh, it's only four mum, quid a mum, bottle. Mum says she's just shown me a Sauvignon Blanc from Aldi at 3 99 She says it's the nicest one she has ever, ever tasted. Yeah. Get yourself some. Mm -hmm. 3 99 from Aldi, they weren't on at 3 99 Well. There you go. Not that I've seen. You have to go and sample mum's before she drinks it all. <laughs> so now we've got our Zambia stamps. We've got one here from 1964. Mm. Now we don't know about prices on these. Um, no. We've got 6D, 4D. So they're all with Ds. No, they're not. This is 9N, 1972. Oh, look one. at this butterfly. Oh. Pretty that one is. I just like looking at pretty stamps. <laughs> like that, colourful stamps. Uh, That's what we like to see. It looks like a bank now, that one. 1988, that one. Some sort of a bird. Oh, that's a nice colourful one. That one there, look. <coughs> All different ones from Zambia. That's quite pretty. It's quite plain, but I quite like that. Yeah. Quite a few with birds on, isn't mm. there? Birds, 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 birds. What sort of birds? Oh, look at that one, like a metallic. Yeah. We've got a buffalo. Mm. Nambia Day, 26th of August, 1975. Oh, cool. 
that stamp has been around that many years it's been around 48 49 years 48 yeah, yeah. 48 oh. years yeah and it it's probably faded slightly but mm. wow yeah very very interesting elephants i think the nice one they ain't got the stamp over the top of them all three yeah look a bit better two elephant ones look that's because they come from zambia oh that's a funky one expect a few elephants from zambia yeah. look it comes with an extra one <laughs> yeah. Yeah. an english stamp <laughs> zambia a chin yao dancer is what it's called so some interesting stamps there. Shall I get on eBay and see if you can find any more cheap, <laughs> cheap ones? Um, they're nice to look through. They're nice to, you know, they're just nice. Uh, but we've got a couple of super thanks to give. Yep. We've got caravaning in Cara the van again. Thank you very much for Thank the much, super like, thanks. Yeah. And we've got Doctor Mong one again. Thank you. Thank you to both of you for the super thanks. It is very, very much appreciated. It really is. Yeah. I'm sure that's everybody because we've saved a couple up. Um, yeah. So thank yeah. you for those, and thank you uh, obviously for the people that have sent us coffees. Yes. And thank you to Wendy, the naughty woman, for sending <laughs> us the PayPal donation. Very we, naughty. We didn't expect you to send us anything. Very naughty, but thank you. Yes, Wendy's the lady <coughs> that we're donating the the um, power bank to. The grow cell power mm, bank to what we did cell, the, yeah. the, the budget one we did the other day yeah um she's made us a cheesecake yes and then she's gone and give us some money on paper so it was very naughty of you wendy it was but we'll be seeing well, her tomorrow for yes. the cheesecake actually we will we'll be doing a swaps as well <coughs> tomorrow a swaps is on your face turn this way my face oh you've cut yourself you're bleeding look mm. yeah bleeding awful Ugh, never honestly. mind so just one birthday to do and that's a uh, happy 53rd birthday um, and that's for the 19th of March John Sparks from yes. your lovely lady Donna happy birthday John so happy birthday to you and that wraps it up for this week it does or, or this video should I say not this week because well, we do more than one a week mm -hmm. so thanks for watching guys and as always we'll see you in the next one after a glass yes or three <laughs>